What's up guys? Day three, we're gonna go over some handstand push-up for you. All right, now the first thing is kicking up onto the wall. All right, I know a lot of you guys are a little bit scared kicking those feet over so you do the wall walk up. But if you really want to become, you know, doing these the right way, you gotta learn how to kick your feet over your head. Another thing that I'm noticing, people like to set their hands first, then kick up, all right? Ultimately, you want to be able to just kick right into the wall. So what you want to think about is keeping your core tight, butt tight, almost like doing a single leg RDL into the wall and those feet go right over. Now, hand placement. You want to try and be, if you have the plates, I like to aim right uh, below this circle, right over here. I like to place my hands right there to make sure that I'm even. Any further than that or farther than that, I feel that I'm going to be too close and then rubbing into the wall. So we almost want to be set up like it's that push press. So when we dip and drive, our head is through. So pretend that your hands are here and you want to get through. Once again, our core tight, our butt is tight. So when we kick up, we're in that single leg RDL, up overhead, and our chin is tucked, looking at that opposite wall. If we're doing them strict, it's down, keeping those elbows in, and then you're up. All right, now when we go for that kip, keep the kip, get those knees, and then drive those feet up, all right? It's gonna be a little bit of a process to not kick into the wall right away. So it's almost like your knees are to your chest and then you're coming almost like a ramp, all right? If you go straight up, you're gonna knock into the wall. So we're here, core tight, butt tight. Deep breath in, elbows in, up, kick up. Deep breath in, and then when you're getting into it, you just gotta get into that rhythm, knees to your chest. All right, come on down. Now, that might have looked a little bit easy, but that took a ton of practice, all right? So, um, if you're just getting started today, maybe some handstand holds to get warmed up with, get some uh, exposure to being overhead like that, all right? Those are your helpful hints for today, and let's get